Hey, Stephen Christopher from Wit Digital here, and today I want to share four tips uh, that can help you out during these very interesting and potentially challenging times. So, uh, step number one for the business is get together some sort of a letter or a communication that talks to your customers about the steps that you're taking to protect your team, protect their home, protect your community, um, anything else that you're doing in the community. Uh, we're creating a kind of a template that you can utilize and uh, the link for that will be um, below this video. Um, if you're doing any non-digital marketing, it might be an opportunity to look at some of that. For example, a lot less people are gonna be driving around for a little while. Is there some billboard stuff that you could potentially cut? You wanna be cautious about cutting things that are um, digital focused. That even means things like TV. A lot of people are gonna be stuck inside. A lot of people are gonna be watching TV. They're gonna be on the internet a lot more. So hold out on cutting some of those digital things as long as you possibly can. Um, a lot of your competitors are gonna be cutting that type of stuff, and this is an opportunity to, uh, to leapfrog them. I know just from a standpoint purely, like for example on SEO, a lot of people are gonna be taking their eye off the ball. A lot of digital agencies are not quite sure exactly what they're doing in this time, and um, this is a great opportunity for you to, uh, to take some steps to, um, to overtake them in organic ranking. Um, number three, take into account your staffing levels. So do you have enough staff available to handle the calls? Are you getting too many leads for the staff that you currently have? How are you going to decide how to prioritize though? Am uh, prioritize those. Amazon just announced that it's going to be prioritizing shipments. So what task are you going to be prioritizing in your business? Um, depending on the area of the country that you're in, you know, AC calls are gonna start coming in. It's gonna to start to get warm. People still need this demand service. This is not going away anytime soon. People still need AC. People are still gonna need plumbing. So these calls are going to continue to come in. So just make sure that, you, uh, that your staffing needs are met and that you're figuring out how to prioritize those calls that you're gonna to do to make sure you're running the highest priority ones um, and maybe some of the ones that aren't necessarily as, as high priority or as beneficial to the business right now that you take information and maybe you're, uh, you're calling those people back over the course of the next couple weeks. And then fourth is what about doing um, some sort of like a teletech program? So this is a great opportunity to showcase your brand and your commitment to your customers and your community. So what are the opportunities and ways that you could potentially still serve your customers without physically being there in front of them? Now, I know that a lot of the services that you offer and that our clients offer are very technical and you wouldn't wanna to try to train somebody on how to do that or show somebody how to do it, but there's gonna be a lot of very basic things that you might be able to help people with through some sort of a video call. So you could train a couple of your technicians on how to communicate via um, like a web app or even just like FaceTime and little things like if somebody's having an issue with their thermostat, uh, somebody can do a video call to help walk that person through and help them troubleshoot. So be creative in these times. What are ways that you can benefit your community benefit your customers and your clients so that now you're continuing to support them in this interesting time and continuing to build your brand. So those are just four quick steps that everybody in this home service industry can be taking right now in these uncertain, in these very interesting, but uh, also times of opportunity. So if we can do anything to help, please absolutely let us know. We're 100% operational right now. We are serving all of our clients. We're also going above and beyond. Uh, doing some business coaching, mindset coaching, whatever it is that you need in this community, we are here to support you. So please don't hesitate to reach out. Stay safe. Um, we're all gonna get through this. It's gonna be over before we know it. We've been through things like this before. Um, as a community and as a global community, we will make it through this. Appreciate you. Have a fantastic day.